Earth has been around for four and a half billion years. In that time, it has seen some very dramatic changes at the hands of the natural world, but also of our own making. These changes have led to us being at the pinnacle of civilization, as far as we are aware. But although our third rock from the sun has been around for so long, it is still threatened by various factors that could result in our floating planet becoming no more than another lifeless asteroid floating through space, and that if we're lucky. This video is going to look at 10 doomsday scenarios where the Earth is destroyed and what would be responsible. Before we look at this, a quick reminder to give this video a thumbs up if you're enjoying it and also to subscribe to Brain Impact for more videos just like this one. For now, let's look at 10 things that could destroy Earth. Let's start at 10 with the one that is literally the hot topic worldwide as we speak, and that is climate change. In recent decades, scientific research has confirmed that Earth's temperature is rising steadily and it's due to us releasing greenhouse gases that trap heat within our atmosphere. In the short term, the rise in heat may not seem like such a problem, but unless we change our behavior around carbon, then the planet will reach a temperature that is no longer sustainable for human life on Earth. It's thought that if there's a 4 degree centigrade change in Earth's temperature, there may be catastrophic consequences where our land is no longer fit to grow food and natural disasters are commonplace. Next at number 9 is another man-made issue and something that represents the most destructive side of humanity. Nuclear War When the US dropped atomic weapons on Japan in 1945 to mark the beginning of the end of the war, they showed the immense power that nuclear weapons were capable of. That was 75 years ago. Now countries worldwide have nuclear capabilities and if they chose to use these against each other in warfare, the fallout that would rain upon the Earth is likely to be so severe that it would scorch the Earth and leave our planet no more than a wasteland. And number 8 is a natural threat to us and that's a supervolcano. It's well known that an asteroid was the reason for the mass extinction of the dinosaurs 65 million years ago, but what isn't so documented is an extinction caused by a volcano. The Permian-Triassic extinction event left around 90% of all species at the time extinct and it's thought that a supervolcano was responsible. It's believed that this threat is very unlikely, but if an eruption does hit, then the planet would struggle to deal with the after-effects. Scientists believe that an eruption could affect the climate, damage the biosphere, affect food supplies, and create political instability. Next, at 7, is one that has been created by us but threatens to take on a life of its own, artificial intelligence. The fear with artificial intelligence is a Terminator-type scenario where robots become sophisticated enough to develop themselves and grow at a frightening rate. This is combined with the worry that robots will see humanity as superfluous in their development and choose to destroy us. There is a school of thought that instead of this scenario, artificial intelligence may choose to be friendly to humanity, but there is a larger group that feels due to a machine's inability to feel empathy, they will merely destroy all in its path. Before we reach the halfway point on this list, we're going to look at supernovas at number 6. Put simply, a supernova is when a star explodes. Now, our sun isn't going to suffer this fate as, believe it or not, it's not big enough. Supernovas happen at a rate of about 50 years. If we were in the direction of one, we wouldn't be completely destroyed, but the whole atmosphere would be, so say goodbye to life on Earth as we know it. The supernova would bring with it clouds of dust and gas weighing much more than our entire solar system. We are halfway through our list now, so stay with us to see the rest of our top 10 ways the Earth could be destroyed. Remember to like this video and also click that notification bell to get the latest videos on science from Brain Impact. Now back to our list. The next scenario at number 5 is a strange one but could happen to our planet as well as our whole galaxy. This is the prospect of another galaxy engulfing our own Milky Way, also known as galaxy cannibalization. Recently, astronomer Stephen Majewski showed that the Milky Way recently did this to the Sagittarius galaxy. 
and it's thought that our neighboring galaxy, Andromeda, is going to absorb a counterpart known as M33 in the constellation of Triangulum. This cannibalization is natural and contributes to the destruction as well as formation of galaxies. At number 4 is the one that we are currently living through, a global pandemic. Now this one isn't likely to destroy the Earth entirely, but it has the potential to destroy all life on Earth. We only have to look at COVID-19 to understand what damage a pandemic can cause. The modern world has made massive medical strides over recent decades, so thankfully it looks like a solution is now being administered to humanity. However, the modern world also brings with it globalization. This makes it incredibly easy for a virus to spread from country to country, and whereas in the past diseases may have stayed localized, now humanity has the potential to be wiped out from any new virus that we haven't had time to study. Even if humanity survives, it's thought that if a future pandemic were to hit and leave only a few immune survivors, these survivors wouldn't be able to maintain the huge infrastructure that we've built for ourselves, and this would all collapse. Into our top three now, and we're looking at gamma rays. We're not talking superheroes here, but a very real threat, even if we don't anticipate it happening tomorrow. A gamma ray is an electromagnetic radiation of very high energy that has extremely high frequencies. This means they have properties of high energies and small wavelengths. This kind of ray has the potential to strip out the Earth's UV, exposing us to the harshness of radiation and causing a mass extinction. This isn't the stuff of science fiction. It's believed a gamma ray caused the Ordovician Silurian planetary extinction of around 444 million years ago, wiping out 85% of species at the time with it. At number two, the next thing to look at isn't so much something that could destroy Earth, what's more accurate is that it will destroy the Earth. This is the death of the Sun. The Sun is an energy source, and like with all energy sources, it will die eventually. Thankfully, this process won't fully reach its dramatic climax for another 5 million years. At this point, it will grow up to 8 times bigger than it is currently. This will begin once all hydrogen is exhausted in the core. It becomes unstable and collapses under its own weight. It will engulf Mercury and Venus, and it's likely that the Earth will be a victim as well. Of course, the increase in temperature will mean that our planet will long be scorched and unrecognizable at this point. It's well known that our planet won't live on forever because of this fact, but we've got plenty of time before we have to worry about the sun dying. Now, our number one thing that could destroy the Earth, and it's something that has inspired several movies as well as a dedicated NASA team looking to avoid its effects an asteroid impact. We know asteroids have the power to disrupt the Earth because it's happened before, and on a smaller scale, it happens fairly frequently. The Chicxulub impact 66 million years ago is thought to have been responsible for the mass extinction of the dinosaurs. In 1908, the Tunguska event occurred after an asteroid hit Siberia, wiping out the surrounding area. This is the largest known impact to have been recorded. Although the odds of another planet-altering asteroid hitting us anytime soon are very low, they are high enough for scientists like Stephen Hawking to advise finding another planet to populate to ensure our survival. NASA has a dedicated team that tracks asteroids and technology is now able to identify those that pose a significant threat. However, are we able to do anything about them if we do find them? Well, these solutions are being developed at a quick rate. These range from detonating nuclear weapons to sending the rock off track through to landing a rocket on the surface to divert the threat off course. Initial testing has gone well and confidence is building every year that goes by that we'd be able to identify as well as steer an asteroid off course if it posed a threat. These doomsday scenarios range from the highly unlikely through to those that trouble us today. What's clear is that it's man-made threats that represent the most significant in our world today, and that action needs to be taken sooner rather than later to remedy it. The more natural threats are those that will probably affect the planet and have the potential to do so at any time, but the odds are that these catastrophic events are unlikely to happen in our lifetime. We might not be so lucky with the threats that we created ourselves. So these are 10 things that could destroy the Earth. 
Which one do you think is the most likely to happen? Let us know in the comments and please like this video if you've enjoyed it. If you want to see more videos like this one, then subscribe to Brain Impact for more. Thanks for watching.